In Windows, the ability to keep a program or application on top of all other programs, meaning that it floats or rests on top, is a very useful feature from time to time, especially if you're working with multiple applications or windows and there's one you're always referring back to, it would be great to have that window be on top. To show you what I mean is I have this software program quick screen capture to be set on top of all others, meaning no matter what window or program that I bring within the work area of quick screen capture, quick screen capture always remains on top. And this is real useful, like, for example, if you're working on a web page and maybe there's an application you're using with that web page or website for one reason or another, you can go back to that web page and work with it, interface with it, without this program falling in the background for you to have to find again. It stays on top. The easiest and quickest way to keep any window on top of all others is with a 100% free, very small application called like it on top. All you do is you run the program. It sits in your system tray so it's out of the way. You just click this button, tray me, and it goes there. Click on the tray icon, it reappears. All you have to do is click your mouse on the window you want to be on top, and that window's title or name will appear in the program. All you do at that point is you click on the checkbox and then that window is going to remain on top of all others. See how now I'm clicking on quick screen capture and it falls behind this application here. And if you want to remove it from top, just uncheck the checkbox. And now you can select another application to put on top. And again, now this application is on top. Very small, easy to use application, total file size is 60 kilobyte, uses uh, around 2K of memory, which is nothing. You can access and download this program 100% free from the website eventips.com slash internet, how to keep window on top of all others, and the short link is here, and I will put these links in the video's description as well. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you at evanstips.com dot com.